So you're going to need the latest update for the game as well. And you can find that on our website. So let's go to uh, our web browser. We're using Safari. Uh, we normally use uh, Mozilla Firefox, which is a free download if you can get it. Um, we're going to click here. We'll type in Aspire, A-S-P-Y-R, dot com. Okay. It'll take you to our website. And we're going to click on the top here where it says Patches. It'll open a new browser. And there's going to be a list of games here. Scroll down until you see The Sims 2. It's going to be right here. And you want to install the Sims 2 combo patch. Okay. Because uh, this update contains the new content for all of uh, all the expansions. So even if you don't have an expansion, this is the one we prefer to use. It's the most recent one. Let's go ahead and click that. We'll bring up this site. And it'll explain what gets updated with that patch right here. Now, if you scroll down to Solution, it'll give you the update link. If you click the first one, it'll start downloading. Okay. Now, this is going to take a while. As you can see, it is a 424 megabyte uh, update. So, depending on your internet connection, this could take a while. I've already got it downloaded, so I'm going to cancel this one here. But you shouldn't do that. You should let it download. And hopefully it downloads to your desktop like it does on my computer. If not, you can set that up in uh, Safari. Let's close the downloads window. Let's close the web browser. And it's going to look something like this. Okay. So now let's double click that. I'll continue. Looks a lot like the uh, expansion installers, right? Continue. Again, make sure you read through this information so you know exactly what it is you're installing. Uh, I'm going to breeze by this for a bit. Continue. Agree. Again, select where you're installing the update to. So we're going to the Macintosh HD main hard drive. And continue. Now, this is a common problem where it, it'll normally not find your uh, your main game here and it did find mine but sometimes it won't and it'll just tell you that it couldn't find anything if you just click on other it'll pop up with a search window and you can just go manually into your applications and look for the sims 2 and select the game okay, and when you do that you just click open and the game will be here. So now click continue. Make sure you check this box here under package. Okay. Make sure that it's checked. And now click install. Again, it'll ask for your personal user password. And there it goes. And that was it. It is successfully installed. So let's close that. Now you can go into your hard drive, applications. The Sims 2, and you're going to have the latest version of the game. You're going to be able to open it up and play it. 